All right, Coach, about a week out now from Penn State. Uh, how's your uh, feelings on the team right now? Good day. We had a good day today and getting some guys back off injury, offensive line, but uh, feel good about where we're at. Uh, had a bunch of game situations today we got covered, and uh, the kids were sharp and focused, and that's encouraging. Talk about the importance of doing something like today so that way next Saturday isn't such a culture shock. You know, the thing is, is I've always felt like you got to take your players through the steps and uh, going through everything from where you sit on the bench to what takes place at halftime to how you put your shoes on, how you put your socks on, who goes out and stretches when, what times, you know, Lord's Prayer. All, I mean, just tons of things that go into a pregame. And during the game, you know, safety, safety returns, all those kind of things. We did all those today. So uh, the purpose of that is so the kids feel comfortable and uh, they don't have to lay in bed at night and worry about, well, where do I stretch tomorrow? How do I get dressed? Where am I going to be sitting? You know, that's all taken care of. How anxious is everybody for next Saturday? Oh, I think it's exciting. You know, it's um, a great opportunity. Uh, Penn State's obviously a great football program. A top 25 team, and uh, it's a great atmosphere, and uh, it'll be a quick trip, and we're looking forward to it. Talk about uh, over your shoulder, the Watts is moving forward pretty good. Yeah. Talk about what that's going to be for I think it looks pretty us. good, doesn't it? Uh-huh. The, uh, the big barn, but, uh, no, that's exciting, and, uh, you know, once we get this facility, we'll have everything we need to uh, compete with, obviously, anyone in the in football and recruiting. It'll be a premier facility here. It's got a full-length track around it, and, you know, there's a bunch of people here at Youngstown State that will use it just besides the football team. Uh, you know, all of our track teams, baseball, softball, you know, and you're able to work out basically all year long and run and do those kind of things where normally in the winter you're in, you can't because of the weather. 